everybody. Welcome back to Tactical Breach Wizards, a, uh, a new puzzle game that uh, has a very unique aesthetic, and I am enjoying it quite a bit. <laughs> uh, we just finished Act 1. Very cool. Got to fight the, the Traffic Warlock, which was the, uh, the boss of the area. Now we're on to Act 2 Extraction. Let's move on. Didn't like that guy. <laughs> Right? Steve is always an asshole, but he's never uh, actively thrown a ghost car at me before. New low. When we get back, you can scry again to find out where they took banks. Oh, no need. Blood scrying updates in real time for about 36 hours. Shit, that's impressive. Can't beat blood for utility. <laughs> Can't beat blood for utility hexes. Where is she now? North by 80 kilometers already? Is that possible? Is she moving? Give me a sec. Yes. Yeah, extremely yes. God, like 400 meters since I last asked, since you last asked. They've got a chopper. Of course they've got a chopper. Man, chasing a multi-billion dollar PMC uh, best operative in public transport is surprisingly hard. <laughs> Where do you think they're headed? Liboli? Reactor has a black site west of Aldo. Nice quiet place where they can do what they want to prisoners like Banks. Then I guess we're heading to Liboli. Yeah. And like... 14 hours when the next ferry leaves. Can we stay at your mom's place tonight? Yeah, she'd love that. <laughs> she should be back from bingo by now, actually. Oh, we're gonna get to meet his mom! I hope. Back to Ma's for a nice cup of tea. Hey, it's her. Damn, dude. Like, with his white beard and shit, I honestly didn't expect her to be alive. <laughs> That's pretty insane. Wizards must have a quite the lifespan, I guess. Oh, Lordy. You didn't tell me we we're having companies in. I would have cleaned. God, <laughs> what must you think, duck? That I live in filth? Did she call us a duck? <laughs> she calling her a duck? I actually think it's lovely, Miss Vesker. Uh, oh, you should see my flat. Can't move <laughs> through all the gold scopes. <laughs> no, I think it's lovely. This is Jan. Uh, Jen. <laughs> Do you remember I mentioned her? I know I don't remember. You know I don't remember my own name half the time, duck. Lovely to meet you, Jen. Can I get you a brandy? Or something stronger? I would absolutely love a brandy. Thank you. Ah, uh, wonderful. Gives me an excuse to have the stiffer, t <laughs> have a stiffer too, doesn't it? She laughs loudly. Now, how long will you kids be staying? Just the night, if that's okay, Ma. Of course, love. Stay as long as you like. Where are you off to tomorrow? Liboli. Oh, how wonderful. You must take Jen to the Naval Museum in Aldo. You remember where I used to take you on your birthday? She'd love it, Zan. We're there to stop a team of Black Ops wizards torturing a hostage and starting World War V, Ma. I'm not sure there'll be time for a museum. Oh, it's such a lovely country, Jen. Not like here. Didn't you and dad flee for your lives because a pharma corp tried to kill for him for whistleblowing? Well, every country has its problems, duck. Have you been, Jin? I have. Actually, it's where Zan and I met uh, when I did my mandatory tour. Oh, so you know, lovely. I expect he's told you his origin story. And winces. That's not what we call it, Ma. 
<laughs> and I'm sure she doesn't want to. Oh, I'd absolutely want to hear the or your origin story. Oh, God. And we have a map to update. I saw your map. It's lovely to see you doing crafts again, Doc. I'm glad someone's finally using those wretched thumbtacks. Uh, I bought that box in 1943, and I've scarcely made a dent. What's a it about? There's no easy way to say this, Miss Vesker, Mrs. Vesker. Uh, but your son is terrible at filing. <laughs> I had a system. I just never got around to making the system. Ah, uh, you've got your father's spirit, Zan. Oh, that's sweet. No, he had a terrible spirit. <laughs> just a dog shit spirit. Ah. Well, I'm sorry. But that man would give up on anything. I once saw him give up on a spoon. Slipped out of his hand and he just left it there, ate pudding with his fingers flimsy soul too Jesus okay all right live let's get uh all right uh <laughs> all right let's get Liv's team on here okay takes orders from Liv takes orders from Liv okay <laughs> and the mana stockpile Stored at Rushwater PD? Or... No, it was the Stone Clay Lop Up, right? Oh, and he burned Rushwater PD, right? No. Guess he did that. Wait, what did he burn? Oh, he bur oh, he burned the, the, the mana stockpile. <laughs> I was thinking he burned down this place, but... And here's the black site. Cool. Ah, uh, taken to the black site. Hey, that all makes sense to me. No rush if you want to rearrange or go over the details, though. Okay, cool. We're going to read some of these. Smarmy Prick, who can, I guess, summon phantasmal apparitions of long dead highway traffic that hurt a lot if they hit you. He was always the department's darling, but now he seems to be working with the team that just hit the Rushwater PD, and I don't think the station knows it yet. It is killing me that I wasn't around to rat him out to his fan club. Cool, what about this guy, Bori Kesh, the less lethal pyromancer? Zan, you're going to have to take this one because I'm honestly still not sure I understand this guy's deal. Fine, his talent creates a magical fire that never gets above a certain temperature. So it won't incinerate you, you'll just pass out from the heat stroke. <laughs> Given that, it's a little weird that he joined a team that's been killing people all over the globe, but here we are. Okay, in the mana stockpile. Unlocking your craft tends to happen when a life-threatening situation brings it out of you. If you're not willing to wait for one, why not create it yourself? 10 grams of street mana and a shot of absinthe is a small, wildly inexpensive or wildly expensive recipe for a huge risk of brain damage or death. Aurelium calcite activates the craft center of the brain. And some people unlock a temporary power while the high lasts. It's not permanent, though. And when you don't know what your power is, there's a whole range of ways to die finding out. Cut it with MDMA and acid, or acid, and you've got street mana. It's a monos... Mosnomer? Misnomer? Uh, the few who can hold the beryllium... Uh, sell it to trust fund kids at mansion pool parties and money men by private courier. Millionaires who think they're invincible, ma uh, mad that they there's a type of power they can't they don't have yet. Uh, the stock power at Stone stockpile at Stonecliff must be years of seizures. Why didn't they destroy it? More to the point, why did live? Interesting. 
Here's a lockup. I was hoping I'd be able to waltz into Stonecliff lockup before they heard what went down at Rushwater. Uh, but no such luck. We managed to get the blood sample they took from Banks when they booked her, though, so I can track her with a scrying spell. Uh, we don't have to look far. She was in the next building. We didn't have to look far. She was in the next building, still with the team who took her. Uh, they were there to burn an alarmingly large stockpile of confiscated mana. Why, though? Ma's place. Seems nice. Zan's mom was uh, good enough to put us up for a while. For uh, Put us up while we figure out our next move. And her place is off the map. Or er, it was. Okay. Now we just got this left. Zan thinks this is where they'll be taking banks. Uh, the direction I feel them heading in backs it up. Okay, cool. I think that's it. We don't have any perk points to spend, so let's move on. You're out of brandy, so I made tea. Do you really want the story? It's longish. Of course. Oh, you'll love this, Jen. Building it up isn't helpful, Mom. <laughs> Okay, this was Ryasi, uh, 78. We're on escort duty for the RNS diplomat. And our APC driver, Valdini, <laughs> she's hearing a noise that doesn't uh, like, that she doesn't like from the chassis. We pull over, and of course, as the FNG, she sends me under the uh, there to check it out. Uh, FNG stands for a uh, fucking new guy. Yeah, that's fun. Uh, <laughs> and I find three kilos of plastic colored wires, blinking red lights, the works. I don't know if I have seconds or minutes before it blows up. I don't even have wire cutters. All I can think is to rip all the wires out at once. But as soon as I think it, there's this flash of pain so sharp, I think it's blown already. But it's still there. So I think about just ripping out the green wire and flash. It hits me again. When I think about ripping out the blue wire, though, nothing. I just see myself doing it clear as day. So I do it. Red light goes off. And I just fucking collapse. <laughs> and that's it. That's how I unlocked. Adrenaline, delirium, and a desperate need to do exactly what it turns out I can do. So they put you on bomb defusal after that? Who was trying to blow you up? Uh, they put you on bomb defusal after that? No, it turns out most bomb blow... <laughs> My, most bombs blow whichever wire you cut. Uh, once I could foresee without passing it, the brass put me through a craft training program to help control it. Then fast-tracked me to special forces. That's where I met Liv. Who was trying to blow you up? The bomb was a merc job, but this was Ryasi in the 70s. There's no way Chapel Money wasn't behind it. What did Valdini say? Her reaction focused very much on being right about the dragging noise and much less on the discovery that I could see the future. See through time. Good story, move on. Imagine she says move on. <laughs> I don't know where he gets it, Jen. Not a magical bone in my body, nor your father. Especially not your father. I like his little uh, loop-de-loops there on his uniform. That's very funny. Uh, he'd suck the magic right out of anything. It's not hereditary, Mom. But you might have something. You've just never been in a life-or-death situation that required it. Well, it's certainly not... Shut your father up about the quickest route to downtown after 5 p.m. That came up all, uh, all you like. And I thought my life was over every time. 
We better get some rest. First ferry to Lo Liboni. Liboli. As it says, 7 a.m. Okay, well, that was easy. Hey, now we finally, we finally completed the break. And now we're on to chapter two, the extraction. First ferry to Liboni. 95 minutes left. Oh, look at a kitty. Is that her stuff? Did she bring her cat with her? <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, it's like a transparent suitcase. It looks like. I guess she did bring her cat, <laughs> which is hilarious. And he left his laser sight on. <laughs> so my contact got back to me. She knows a guy who delivers supplies for reactor. He's gonna let us ride in with a shipment of bathroom supplies and pornography. Very cool. Oh, phew. I thought getting there was going to be a whole thing. You serve with live wrong enough. A lot of people want to get on your good side. I didn't tell her it's live. We're tracking. Banks hasn't moved, which fits with her being held at the black site. If she's still there, Liv's still there. My gut says they need her for something. If you're right about the stakes of this, we need to get there yesterday. I feel like we've moved about four inches in every two hours on oh, the cat sleeping now. Very cute. Yeah, this is torture. I'm going to find somewhere to <laughs> kip. What does that mean? Am I stupid? Oh, what the hell is this? Chats. This is the chats menu. Optional conversations that can be played at any time. If you just want to move on for now, you can always play them later. Choices made in these don't affect the outcome of the campaign. Unplayed played. What's your cat's name? What's your cat's name? Daryl. <laughs> you named your cat Daryl? My mom did. She isn't really a cat person. Well, he's a treasure. What does he do? You mean magic? Nothing. I think he's in legal. <laughs> uh, he licks his own butthole, then looks at you like you should be ashamed. He's surprisingly chill about being on the ship. Yeah, we think he was a uh, ship's cat. Ship's cat before mom adopted him. If we let him out of his cage, he'll kill both of us and then leap into the sea like a tortured poet. I think he's just such a has such disdain for life that he won't acknowledge this <laughs> is any worse than usual. Uh, he'll kill us all. I think we could take Daryl. No offense, Daryl. Very cool. Uh, how are you sure about all this? Can I ask you something? Shoot. How are you so sure about all this? I just love that they're decked out in military gear just on this ferry and no one's batting an eye. Oh, I didn't know I could scroll. That's cool. Uh, you were always the guy double checking our orders, hedging our bets. Better safe than sorry. No offense, it was comforting. None taken. But now you see an old friend causing trouble and you walk into the police station with an assault staff? I kind of forgot you were this sharp. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. It's not just that Liv's playing with fire. It's that I know what happens in the, a month's time if we do nothing. I thought you could only see one second ahead. On a good day, yeah. When I'm in control. But sometimes I get flashes. They're brief. They're rare. And I don't know how far ahead I'm seeing. So most of them tell me nothing useful and temporal whiplash lays me out for days. In one, though, I saw a date. Oh. 18692. Yo, look at him. He's got some cool shit on him. Got like a sword. It was etched into a massive stone slab. Above a list of hundreds name, hundreds of names, thousands. I can't tell where I am or when I am. And they aren't names I know. But I know it's a war memorial, 
and I'm swallowing a feeling like my throat, like a throat full of rocks. I did nothing. When did you have the flash? Three months ago. Right after Liv Kennedy came back on the map. Okay. Those are very abrupt endings. <laughs> I think we're good, though. Right? Yeah. Let's move on. Zan's brain. Bear with it. <laughs> uh, hi? Hi. Oh, wait. Are you really here? Explain where here is, then ask me again. Shit, sorry. I thought you were in my... I think you're in my dream. This happens sometimes. My foresight runs wild while I'm asleep, and it can drag in others' casters if they're dreaming too. Gonna need some clarity on runs wild. Well, okay, it runs combat drills. Combat's when I use it most. Combat's when I use it most, so that's what it knows. So we're about to fight a completely meaningless battle? Yeah, sorry. I can kill you if you like. That'd probably wake you up. Nah, I'm good. I can use the practice, to be honest. I don't get... <laughs> I don't get shot at much in a typical private investigation. Yeah, they're not bad for building confidence. Alright, let's breach. Okay. Knock out all enemies four left. Oh, and traffic warlocks there. Cool. Very, very small room. I'm assuming you can just knock him out. Ah, but I need line of sight. Oh, ho, ho. if I go here, do I have line of sight? I do. Get fucked. Okay. Very cool. And then... Oh, I need an action. That's right. Okay. So can I take cover? And then it's just this guy. That's a problem for me. So actually, let me rewind that. Uh, what the fuck? Actually, breach? Yeah, my bad. Uh, let me go here. And then let me go chain bolt. Uh, is this air canister causes three knockback to all adjacent targets if damaged? Am I an adjacent target? It'd be good to know. <laughs> um, I think I can just. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, that didn't actually help as much as I'd like. Okay, so let me rewind that. Let me go back over here. Try something different here. Because I can see these two with that from here. Hmm. So that'll knock back three. So if I damage that, he will go out the window here. That's pretty good. And if I damage him, he'll go out the window. So if I do that... That works. And then I can move over here, just for fun. I can actually just Gale Grenade this guy out. And just... That was brief. Yeah, there's usually a bit more of them than that. Want to do another? Uh, oh, okay. I didn't even realize I did this. Okay, cool. Uh, done. Very cool. Got a confidence. That's cool. Clean. Efficient. Did it on one turn. Easy peasy. Dream training, standalone challenge missions, improving ground, replayable survival challenges. Oh, okay. Rushwater dreams, sand corridors, and backup, witch storm, wackador. 
These are all pretty cool. Let's try one. Okay. Knock out all enemies. Prevent three reinforcements in total. And I have two Zans. That's interesting. Uh, what happens if I... Okay, that just kills him immediately. That's cool. I did not know that. Breached like that. Um... Okay, so these guys are the immediate threat, it seems. We need to access the laptop to defeat the level. These guys are going to be coming in. I think if I move here... Let's see what happens if I move here, and then... I can just kill that guy outright, and kill that guy outright, and kill this guy outright. But I only get one shot of that. Or I can time boost and I can get two actions, which means two shots. And then I can use the other shot for him. So if I go here. I can't really get any good cover other than here. So let, oh, we can grab the intel. And then the time boost is a mana cost. It's not even uh Okay, so let's let's do that. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. There we go. That'll boost him. And then we can We can just boost each other, I guess. That's a pretty good play, ain't it? And we can take all these guys out. Um, I can do that. That's one. That's two. Then I can go over here and then I can hit both of these guys, right? That will do one damage. Well, yeah, it will do one damage to him. So let's not do that, actually. Uh, let us... You can hit both of these guys. Okay, so why don't we go here and hit this guy? Right, and then for here, we can just take out these two. And honestly, if I'm taking out all these guys, I can move up further. So let's rewind all the way back to the beginning. We're going to breach. Kill that guy. Well, that's actually as far as we can go here. And then if we go here, this is as far as we can go here. And now I don't have a shot on this guy over here. So maybe if I go here, that gives me a shot on all of them. That's good. Um, time boost each other. Time boost each other, and then we just take them all out. Right? This Zan takes out these two. While this Zan takes out these two. And then we can predictive bolt here. Do we need to? Is the thing. Can't really do much there. Uh, I don't think we need to do that. Let's just end our turn here. Okay, that's scary. Um, okay, so if I go here... I can seal the door to gain one mana. That doesn't take an action. Any action. Um, we can kill this guy. 
Then we can take Xan over here. Ooh. Okay, hold on. Prevent reinforcements in total. Okay. So he's going to attack me there and attack me there diagonally. Not really a good way I can. Unless I go back here. How many reinforcements are left on there? Two? Okay, so I still have. So if I go back here, take this intel. Predictive bolt here. And then as he goes for him, he'll die. This will blow. And then I could probably move to there from there. If I'm being real. I think that's fine. Oh, and then I can predict about this. And then that should be good. Bam. Cool. And then we in turn. Are you sure? Yes. That kills him. We go here. We seal the door. We go here. We go here. We get the laptop. And we're done. Very cool. Very clean. That works. That works out very well. <laughs> very cool. I like that a lot. Uh, let's do another one, shall we? We can take a break from the main story. Oh, we actually unlocked outfits. Oh, I got to spin this. Okay, whiz tech looks fucking cool. That looks fucking cool. Dark art. Oh, I might go whiz tech, honestly. Whiz tech looks cool. Unlock costume. Testing five plus confidence. Very cool. Okay, I think this is his best costume, honestly. It's so sick. I do like the leaves on this one, and my favorite color is green, but... This one does look the coolest, in my opinion. Uh, she's only got two. That's fine. Let's do one more. Uh, for confidence for Zen. Okay. Then back up. Let's see what this is. Okay. Zan just by himself? I get a reinforcement, it seems? What is... Knock out all enemies and reinforcements. Oh, shit on my ball sack. God damn. So this one hasn't activated yet. There's two remaining from here. I can't time boost myself, unfortunately. Can I... Okay, I can. I can take out these two guys. So I can take out those two guys. Where can I move to? Where should I move to? Is the question. Over here? No, over here. No. Here. Is the play. That's the only one I can go to. Should I just go for this, actually? Actually, that's probably the play. If I go, if I knock this guy out, if I do this, goodbye, retard. And then we go over here. He won't be able to come and attack me. Hmm. Let's try it. Let's go over here. Let's get this intel. Someone's going to be coming out here so we can set this up for sure. I think that's good. He's not going to be able to do anything. He can't attack me or anything. I'm getting another Xan, it looks like. So he can take care of these guys on this side. Hopefully. Let's, let's, uh, let's see. Get fucked. Okay. Now we have problems. Um. Time boost each other? Time boost each other, maybe? Uh, cause 
predictive bolt to fire before the 4C phase. That's going to be a bit tricky. Unless I do some maneuvering right now. If I go here... Oh, this one's on cooldown. Okay. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. If I go here... And I predict a bolt over here. Oh, well, let me, uh, let me actually time boost each other here. Oops. Not what I meant to do. Time boost. Time boost. Well, that was kind of actually probably a waste. Let me, hold on. <laughs> uh, because if I, do I need another action is the thing. Can I even take this guy out? I cannot. With two actions, I could. I could take this guy out, but I want to use an action to get this guy. And get that uh, predictive bolt thing. I think we'll be okay. If I do this and go here, predictive bolt over here, then use him to go like right here and then hit him into the line of fire. That does my prerequisite or my my whatever, whatever this is, confidence. I think honestly, we're just going to have to take these guys on. I don't think there's going to be much we can do about that. Unfortunately, we're also going to have to take these guys on. Well. One use per turn. Okay, okay, okay. So I can't actually. Okay, well, hold on. If I. Still have him come after me somehow. I can't. Mm. Okay. If I go here, I can't hit him. Okay. So if I go here, I can hit him. And I got a 50-50 shot to guess which way this dude is going. <laughs> Let me count the tiles. One, two, three, four, five to me, and then one, two, three, four, five. I think he's going to come this way. I think this is the shortest path here. I don't know if he's going to get to me, is the thing. And then you here. Okay, this doesn't cost an action, so I can actually... Okay, let me rewind to where... Okay, so let me go here. Let me time boost him. And then we can redo all our plays here. Predictive bolt here. Then we use this to go here. Get this guy to die. Predictive bolt there. And then for here... Hmm, I can't kill him. Never mind. I thought I could kill him. Well, that was kind of a waste of mana then. If I'm not doing that. Yeah, I think the... I think we had it the first time. Unfortunately. We're gonna have to reset this up so many goddamn times. Uh, bam. And then bam. Enemy already there. Yes, I know. Uh, okay, I... Th well, I might as well hit this guy while I can. And then we end our turn. Oh, I get another Xan. Oh, shit, I didn't even see that. Okay, this is a problem. 
This is for sure a problem. If I go here, I can't do it. Oh, yikes. Okay. Um, okay, well, now I have three Zans and a ton of problems here. Holy shit. Okay, let's take a look here first. If I go here, I can grab this intel. I can't time boost anyone. Should I time boost is the thing. So, okay, let's just, let's feel things out. So if I go here, I go predictable here. Actually, you know, I'm rewind. Let me do a, I can't really attack anyone. So predictable is all I can really do. I can grab this. I can predictable here. That means when he comes over here, I'll kill him. He can't attack anyone. Well, actually, hold your horses. If I go here. This is a fucking problem. <laughs> so if I go here, I use this Xan. No, no, no. This Xan, Jesus Christ, I wish they were differentiated. Uh, if I use this guy and I predict a bolt here, Okay, so if I time boost him there and predict a bolt here, that'll kill this guy. Then with this Zan, I can kill this guy, right? He's dead. He's dead. Now we've just got a problem with these three <laughs> and then the ones coming in. So I don't want to time boost because... I don't keep that action, right? I don't think so. I don't think I keep that action. So he's dead. Now I need this Xan over here to get over here. Well, that actually doesn't help. I think I'll go, no, no, absolutely not. I can't do it there. I can't do it there. Because I want to predict a bolt one of these guys to death, at least. But here, he can attack me diagonally, which doesn't help me. I think I just have to go here. And then... I can kill him with two attacks. Or I can just straight up... Or I can kill any of these guys with two attacks. Well, I can kill... These two with two attacks, I should say. So if I go here and I time boost him and then I guess I'll kill the closest one to me. Now he's dead. I can predict a bolt here now and kill this guy instantly. That's good. The only thing is this guy has a move, or either of these guys have moved, so I think that's good, though. Yeah, I think that's dead. I like that outcome. That's another dead guy. That's concerning. That's a big concern. Um... Okay. There's four enemies left. All the doors have been... taken. Right? All the doors are good. Kill this guy one shot. Easy. Then we come back here and predictable these other dudes, I think. If we all run back there. Okay, he can't. He can get right here. Which then I can kill him. I can predictable this way. Then I can get this guy to move 
Uh, hmm, where do I want him, actually? Actually... I can make him go here and predictive bolt this way, killing him. All right, well, can I just... Well, if I... Hold on. Let's time boost him. Let's... Not that one. This one. If I go here... I can just shoot him out of existence. That's good. I can... I can predict it both this way. That doesn't really help me, though. I can grab this intel. And I can... Just hold on to that, I think. And then... Okay, I think... I think I fucked this up in particular. Let me... Rewind to where I can move him. I think... He goes here. He... Uh... 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 Okay, he couldn't get over there. I thought he could get over there. Uh, so in that case, let me rewind here. He goes here. He goes here. He goes... Uh, let's take the shot with... This guy. So he's dead now. Now we go here with him. We time boost him with him. And then we get to the right fucking guy. Just shoot the shit out of this guy right out the window. Oh, I didn't realize we could see through there. This windows. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, might as well set this up. I'm gonna grab this intel and then set this up. Then I'm gonna go here. I'm going to predict a bolt here. And here, I'm going to predict a bolt here. 4C. And then we run it. He's dead. Okay, he didn't get in. But... If I just go here and predict a bolt this, that's it, right? That's it, we're done? Okay, cool. <laughs> that took quite a while. Ugh, 15 minutes, holy shit, yeah. That, uh, that definitely felt more advanced than the last one. For sure. We did these two. Witch Storm and then Wackador is next. And then the Clinic. These are replayable survival challenges. That's interesting. So I just have to stay alive as long as I can? Basically? If I'm understanding this correctly? But then, like, how does it end? Like, when I seal off all the doors, how does it end? I don't know. Um, we're going to check that out next time. We're going to be doing these, uh, these little ones. Not a lot of story progress. We didn't do anything story-related, I guess. Uh, oh, well, no, we did... Uh, I guess that does count as <laughs> story progress. But yeah, we got a little bit of lore, a little more lore. Do we get anything from this? I think those dreams are just for confidence, it seems. So maybe we don't want to be doing them. As cool as the costumes are, I don't really... All It gave us one. For 15 minutes of gameplay, give us one of these things. Yeah, actually, looking back on it, I really don't. Uh, I mean, I'll play them eventually, probably, but it'll probably be towards more of the end of the playthrough. 
because this is just for confidence. These are cool and all, but uh, yeah, I think that was a just a tiny bit of waste of time, which is fine. No big deal. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to leave it there. Um, <laughs> bit of a long one for not a lot of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm real. Uh, but next time we're fi probably finally going to get to the uh, the black site, which is super cool. I'll see you in the next one.